from Yankee Stadium in the Bronx. The start of the weekend is MLB upon Saturday. It's Friday evening baseball on the show. It's the Cleveland Guardians taking on the New York Yankees. Yeah, We're playing this whole Parker, series, Chris man. We're playing the Evil Empire. <laughs> big Just like Major League moves. So far this year, Ben Wurtvet leads the team at OPS, so he's the guy that looks to slug and basically make things happen for them offensively. Just a machine in terms of production at the plate. He'll take his walks, he'll barrel up the baseball, he'll hit the ball in the gaps, he'll hit the ball over the fence. So talk about yeah, a guy 41 in bats, yeah. that's him right now, and he's a bat that you want to stay away from if you're the pitcher. Just about to get underway, getting the nod on the mound. Damn, he's ERA 167. Singy, he's a guy that can rack up a lot of strikeouts. I mean, strikeouts. Well, I come, our pitchers can't get them stats. ERA, Damn. Just over three. He's been pretty great for most of his big league career. Can't wait to watch him in this one. And now, Vaughn Harris. This guy is one of the best Harris. athletes in the sport. Already two outs, man. Place to right center base hit. Around first and hustling for second. And that's a two These ain't make me overrun nice the base this time. Right there. Loud contact coming off the bat. Didn't get enough air under to drive it out of here, but you'll that take that swing and that result every time. Look at those gold shoes, baby. Flying. I don't even know why I slid, man. Man, it's a walk in. With two away. Here's Alex Verdugo. So Come on, Verdugo. Spot, but Chris, this is a guy that is not really swinging the bat all that well here. In this situation, you have a real good opportunity to get swings and misses and record a strikeout. They let me creep up this time. Attack him in this spot. Swing get a ball popped up. That's a hit. Oh my God! Come on. And they hold he didn't let me advance. This bastard ass game. Bro. Two consecutive base hits for these guys here. That's a ball that a lot of times you'll see the shortstop or left fielder be able to get to if it hangs up in the air long enough. But right there, it just died and found a way to drop in on the green stuff. With base Come on, Josh. Hit. Damn it. First damn game, bro. Away. Josh Naylor digs in for the Guardians. Left hand hitter on, waits. Josh, it is. Swing and a miss. Game, and that bro. is that. This damn game, yo. Guardians, nothing. What's wrong with these Yankees controls, man? Major League Baseball is on the show. Yeah, I'm sure pressing Back up on the Yankee analog. Stadium, and on the hill in this one, Jonathan Loisica. How about a report on him, Chris? A very forgettable start his last time out. Was only able to work a couple of innings. We're looking for him to put it all together today. Command, tempo, and just really a confident presence out there on the mound. They gonna walk me? Oh, okay. I'm like, this is a different animation. I ain't never seen this before. Pitch. There's a swing and a drive. That's back there. And gone. An absolute blast to left. His 32nd of the year. It's 1-0. He sent the first pitch over the wall. Must have dinner reservations because he wasn't wasting any time at the plate in that at bat. He came out of his shoes. Why do they have him walking like this? Mechanics intact long enough to get to the ball and through it, and it went a long way. I was on that bat all the way around. And up next for Cleveland, Vaughn Harris. How? Singing, you can't ask for anything more. This guy Yo, this game. Swear, man. Yo. He's the ultimate professional, and it doesn't just start at game time. Let me go re-download 20, man. This is crap. For the ball game. I tell you what, his teammates feed off of the leadership. Oh, this one high and deep. Way back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. Well, certainly doing his very best out there on the mound to bring that win streak to a halt. Up next for Cleveland, the left fielder, Alex Verdugo. Isaiah Kiner Falefa up to the plate. So it should have been four to two right now. Isaiah It's already the bottom of the seven, so it really don't matter. We're gonna lose this game. Two two now. Ground ball could be two. 
is not. Balance feed. There's one. Throw the first, but he beat it. This game, yo, just got four runs out of no damn work. DJ Von Harris digs in for the Guardians. Singing, he's a guy that covers both sides of the plate about as well as anyone in the sport. How difficult is that to do? Oh, I'll just look at the back of my bubblegum card. You'll see how hard it is. These guys are great, man. They have the ability to look out there, but also to be able to turn on the inside. That's a base hit as a run scores. Oh, good Harris. shit. I thought. The run down now. I thought they were going to throw it home. <laughs> nah, that was me. That was me that time. I thought they were throwing it home. That was me. That was me that time. And the Guardians three. The number seven is such a cool and sort of lucky number. Well, this team so is the game really would have been tied to win if the game had been games in a row. Uh, there's been some luck and there's been some really good play. I think you get to this point, you start to look at. Can we Baseball fans and welcome Saturday baseball on the show. It's the Cleveland Guardians going up against the New York Yankees joined by my partner Chris Singleton. I'm John Chomby and Chris a guy that's been having a huge impact for this team all year. Aaron Judge always exciting to see him in action and it seems like so two down. So in on, now man, for I'm, Cleveland I'm, I'm Vaughn Harris. Hurts. This guy, one of the best contact men in the sport as well. Outstanding on the defensive end. Swings and blasts one deep to left center. I heard that one. I heard that crack. It bangs off the wall. And he starts his afternoon off right with a double. Man, Singy, he hit that ball right on the sweet spot. According to StatCast, the exit velo 110 miles an hour. Fire. Yeah, Boog, I mean, that right there is an absolute missile. And he just put a great swing on it, squared it up perfectly. Those are the ones that feel really good. Here's Alex Verdugo. Severino kicks deals. Bunting for a hit. Sends it to first. And that is that. <laughs> Why would he bunt when I'm Back on second? In like the that. Rocks, uh, huh? and on the hill, Shane Bieber. Well, hey, do I not understand baseball strategy? Time out, really pitching deep in the games as what would be of the point we'll of bunting? Today, how many innings he's got in him? Bottom of the you first. You would do that like if you're trying to sacrifice. Isaiah maybe Kiner like get a play at home. You don't want to hit into a double play. I, I'm Isaiah. Man, see, long, man, this Kiner game, yo. That one the other way. How the hell was That's I supposed to get that? That's a base hit. And the leadoff man aboard. Well, I was just, I'm up and looking at it like, why is it telling me to run over that way? That I'm not even close to the ball. Didn't get the barrel with it, but the important part was that he found a way to stay through the baseball. And now it's DJ LeMayhew digging in. He's hitting for that pop. Came out of the gates really strong. One down. It's in the bottom of the first, and nobody's on base, and they haven't scored. And a ground ball to first. Like, see, like the game, there's no logic to that. Why isn't the guy on base? Would they call him stealing for something? Like, what? Man, it's second here with two away. Stepping up for the Guardians. Vaughn Harris doubled in his first AB. Hey, let it rip one time. Need you right here. Let's go. That one is absolutely belted. That's back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. Guardians lead one. And we are still scoreless. I'm still going to do my power swing. I don't care. Vaughn as soon as Harris I don't do a pop. See, not 4 0. What the? F this guy has turned into a beast. This is a guy you got to keep an eye on when he digs in. Definitely been known to drop a drag bunt from time to time. And he's pretty good at it, Chris. Yeah, and he creates 
Swing, and this one's blasted. It's got a chance. And gone! He flexes his power with that swing, and they cut into the lead. It's 4-1. Chris, he's homered in back-to-back -back games now. Yep, seeing the ball well, and he's got his timing locked in. He's looking pretty dangerous at the dish right now. Oh, that one got in the jet stream on a line drive. We saw the numbers on the backs of the jerseys of the outfielders, which is usually bad news, and all of a sudden, they're back in this ball game. So the bases are loaded here, one man gone. Ben Wordvet oh, stepping in now for the okay. Yankees. The 2-2. Two -two. Tap to first, Harris. Rosario won. Back to first, double play. Nice job getting over, and that ends the inning. Just trying to sneak one through with the bases loaded, but an excellent job by the defense to turn that one and get out of this jam. And up next for Cleveland, Vaughn Harris. The first baseman, number nine. Swing and a high fly ball, pretty well struck, right field. That's back there. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. Hey, y'all couldn't do that when I had a man on base. Field. His second home run of the game, and they cut into the deficit. It's 4-3. I'm about to go fast forward probably to the end of the game now. The pitcher knew as soon as that ball left his fingertips, it was trouble. Right on a platter, right down the heart of the plate. I'm sorry, but big league hitters don't miss that pitch. Told you. Row, you're this close to double digits, and now all of a sudden it's a challenge within a challenge to get two more wins to get to 10. But there's definitely a high level of confidence that these guys are playing at right now, and that's one of those things you don't want to rock the boat, you don't want to disturb things. Make sure the clubhouse guy is giving you the same good food he's been giving you all along. Something got to give, man, because it, uh, yo. And welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. Today, the finale of this three-game weekend set, it's the Cleveland Guardians taking on the New York Yankees. John Shambi on the play-by-play -play with you. And Chris now, Singleton providing the color. So the New York Yankees are in position to sweep two, this three-game series with a win. So, Chris, what's their mindset heading into today? Yeah, looking to go three for three, Boog. They've already won the series, Seriously, and now bro. they can really leave their mark. It's all about having confidence, and that's what a team takes away from a sweep. So they're happy to win the series, but they'll really be riding high tomorrow with a win today. First pitch coming your way next. All right, just about ready for baseball. Today's starting pitcher, Jamison Tyon. What do you have on him, Siggy? Yeah, got the W last time out. Six innings, a quality start. Hey, if a guy will give you that, you'll take it every single time. Maybe it's the maybe it's something with the coaching. I gotta go look at the coaches after this. Vaughn Harris digs in for the Guardians. Maybe we got one. He's a guy who does it all. Season. Chris, Whoa. baseball today, so Fair many right. strikeouts, and they are available to pitchers. But this is a guy that puts the bat on the ball and is kind of different from the players that we see day in, day out. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. That's back there. That one is gone. Home run number 35 on the year. And they jump out front. It's 2-0. Man, if they got four runs in one of these innings before my third at bat. 
Took on the big part of the yard for that home run and just barely got it over the wall. I thought for a second he brought it back out there too. He gave it a great effort, but you know, those plays are so tough to pull off. And I'm sure he'd love to have another shot at it. Vaughn Harris digs in for the guard. Oh my God, bro. He See what I'm saying? quite an athlete. I mean, you look around the other sports, oh. basketball, football, Harris. you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports too. That one ripped right center field. That's back there. Gone! He'll touch them all. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. And this game is tied. It's 4-4. He ambushed him right there, Siggy. Yeah, swinging on that first pitch. And I think losing one over the fence is exactly what he had in mind as well. Always scary for a pitcher when a guy can take a fastball down the middle and hit it to the opposite field. No holes in a swing like that. And that time, that ball was hit hard. And here is Anthony Rizzo. Singled and scored his first time. Now batting, first baseman, Anthony Rizzo. Tied at four. That one to first. Harris collects it. He takes it himself to the bag, and that'll do it. So the Yanks go in order. Still all square at four apiece. Bottom four, and here is Glaber Torres. Leading off for the Yankees. The second baseman, Glaber. So to the right side, Harris picks it up, takes it himself. Leadoff hitter retired in the fourth. Two on, right, one we go. We need you here. We need and you. now Vaughn Harris. He's got the power, but great contact skills. One of the best contact hitters in the game. Should I go with a normal swing? They're probably trying to set me up. And that one is lifted in the air. That's down. One hops off the wall. Well, there you go. The RBI machine. Another clutch run scoring it back. Yeah, he's been so good in these situations. Call it clutch if you want, but his resume speaks for itself. Here's Jose Ramirez. All the way these two teams have battled in this game, you know you need more. Got to continue to add runs if you're going to get out of here with a win. 3-2 now. Bounce to third. Donaldson handles. Throws across the diamond, and Ramirez is set down. Why is he making me run past third? That's a slide. I ain't seen the pitcher coming over the cover. I would have stayed. And the Yankees four. I was being a jerk right there. Man, it's second with one away. So in now for Cleveland. Oh, so now we act like we got some bats. Really good piece of hitting. Last See, well, this guy ain't just be random as fuck, bro. Let's go. Give it a ride here. Let's go. Ripped That's to the right got. center. Base hit. Here's the throw to the plate. It's off the mark and he scores. And they're pulling away up by seven now. Just so sound in his mechanics. Random as fuck, bro. Front side, and the hands just continue to carry through the middle of the field. Now it's Jose Ramirez. All right, I ain't gonna run this time. Harris over at second, one down. Runner, runner, runner breaks for third. Hard ground ball, base knock. The run comes in from second, and now it's 13 to five. I just throw the base last time. I didn't know the pitcher pitch so slow. I realized that after the first pitch, I'm like, damn, I could have ran on that one. That's not one you're excited to get in front of if you're an infielder. You know they used to say, charge it. <laughs> hey, whoever was booing was loud as hell. <laughs> Bases loaded with one away. Stepping up for the Guardians, Vaughn Harris. This guy with big time power and an elite Harris. defender. Rocketed out towards right center. 
And that's going to be a double, and it'll score two. One run is in. Two runs are in. Oh, I, I, that was an accident. That was an accident. <laughs> I accidentally tapped it. That was accident. <laughs> too late, and he's got a double. Drove that ball nicely, put a great swing on it, and it jumped off his back. Kind of put it all together there, and he's rewarded with the double. Get your pick. Drive it. Oh, and two now. Runner takes off. And a weak ground ball to the left side. Zips it to first. And Ramirez is set down. Well, he didn't recognize changeup earlier enough. Got out in front a little bit. Rolled over on it and beat it into the ground. Number 99. Alex Verdugo. Here's Alex Verdugo. Hey, see it and drive it up. And now the lefty, a swing and a soft liner. That's a base hit as a run scores. Hey, great hit right there. Great hit. Well, that certainly feels good. And up next for Cleveland, Vaughn Harris, a guy who makes an Where was all these runs in the, the last game, bro? Also in the field. Oh, yeah, Boog. He's on the brink of one of your random favorite hit. milestones. He's completed three legs of the cycle. I love me some cycle. Swing and a laser off the bat. This looks like extra bases. And now let's see if he goes for it. And that's a double. A little more backspin on that instead of the top spin. He's jogging around the bases rather than pulling up at second. Now the four-hole hitter for the Guardians, Jose Ramirez. Hey, have a rip right up there now, huh? Steal, steal. Damn. And it's it ain't letting in time. Out number three, inning over to the bottom of the ninth. Well, I don't know what they did in the cage today or on the field. I don't, I don't get these controls, bro. By double digits. I really Something don't. Something is clicking. That batting coach feels pretty good about himself right now, but more so the players. They can't wait for the next one. Come back out, score, and get another W. So this one got a little out of hand. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chomby. Talk to you soon. It almost feel like 2K, like sometimes, like it just take over control of your character on its own. That's a four game series. I'm not going to play that one on this video. <sighs> Man. I ain't even going to say nothing. Be smart. Be safe, y'all. <laughs>